Hey guys, it's Maddie. Um, I just decided to make a vlog about um, housing and room selection. I know the process is about to start for you guys probably. Um, as potential, potential freshmen, you're probably starting to make your choices of, or trying to figure out, you know, who your roommate's going to be and where you're going to live or, you know, um, maybe just applying to be random roommate and kind of looking around dorms, trying to figure out where you want to live, you know, what location. Um, I personally think that there's no difference between living on West Green, East Green, South Green. Um, no difference to me. I mean, everywhere you walk is, you know, 15 minute max time on campus. The campus is not huge, but it's not small either. So, I mean, no matter where you live, you're going to get a good exercise and, you know, classes are everywhere. So, I wouldn't base it um, that much on location. Um, dorms, however, are a little bit different. Whereas mine is a traditional double, um, so that's just me and one other person. Um, and I know there's, you know, a suite style where there's like two people and they share a bathroom and stuff like that. Um, and that's over on South Grand. I honestly do not know much about that, so I would look in more, more into that. But I'm just kind of telling you my personal experience. So I'm living in a traditional double, and I'm on West Green. I live in Sergeant Hall. Um, my traditional level. It is, uh, it's, an, the sergeant's a little bit older, um, actually a lot older, and it's very old. Um, but you couldn't tell that. Like, all the, uh, cabinetry is, it looks very new. I honestly don't know how new it is, but it looks very new. Um, and I mean, nothing seems, like, old and rickety. I mean, I think they've, like, replaced it a lot, and, um, you know, whatever. And I, I personally think that it doesn't matter if things new or old. Um, or like if you live in an old building, I mean, because once you bring all of your stuff in, you make it home no matter what. Um, and so, yeah, so I just wanted to show you around my room today. Um, my roommate's name is Paige. Um, she is also a freshman and she's an education major, early childhood education. Um, so she's not here right now. You're, you'll meet her sometime, I promise. Um, we can do a little interview with her sometime, but um, I just want to show you our room and so it's kind of Pinteresty and girly so like for all the guys watching I'm sorry so okay so there's like walking in the door and like my desk is right next to the door and right now it's kind of like crazy I apologize it's not set up like normal I'm actually drawing a still life um yeah <laughs> uh, kind of crazy so yeah I've got like my all my stuff hung up and then right next to my desk is my bed um, and on you know the wall I've got all my pictures and uh, canvases that I painted and then my bed um, I decided to raise my bed as high as it could go without a loft and I have a lot of storage underneath here um, let's see if I can like lift this up and still be far enough away so yeah I've got these cabinets I've got a basket full of shoes and you know I've got a ton of room down there I have like my backpack um, all sorts of stuff so yeah um, oh, tons of storage and then I have that kind of like a little footstool to step up on my bed because my bed is a little bit higher than normal. And then Paige has her bed a little bit lower to the ground. Um, all this you can do on your own. You can raise it and lower it as you get here. It's really simple. I would recommend bringing um, a little toolkit um, on like when you move in. I have a toolkit um, that I just brought to college with me. I got it for a graduation gift and it was really helpful to kind of move um, the bed to whatever height you'd prefer. So then we've got Paige's bed and um, she also still has a lot of storage in her bed, you know, a laundry basket, a few other baskets full of stuff. Um, so it's really, I mean, she, I, I just wanted mine all, all the way up because I had a lot of, a lot of stuff, you know, a lot of food, of course. So, um, here's her bed and super cute and, um, got all of her pictures up on the wall and, um, here's like our, um, we have like two windows, like it's hard to see obviously because the curtains, but um, two windows and then the air conditioning unit's like half of one of the windows. Um, and if it was, it, it's the night right now, but if it was day I would show you outside the window. Um, we've got a pretty good view and Paige brought those curtains. Um, you can, you can have curtains but you don't have to like because the shades are pretty like, they block out all the light, but it added definitely a cute touch to our room. And then we have our refrigerator, like the typical uh, microwave fridge unit that's in every, um, uh, dorm it's like a fridge and freezer it's in every dorm room um and then we have like all of our cabinetry on this side um so yeah let me show you so we have over here we have like kind of like a mini little cabinet and we have some random stuff for like both of us in there and then we also have like all these like cubbies and we have stuff for like both of us that we share like food and 
um, utensils and like you know paper towels and stuff like that and then here's Paige's desk it's kind of in this little alcove and I love it um, I think it's like I think it's really nice and cozy I'm not sure if all of the um, dorms on West Green have these alcoves but I know Sargent um, definitely does and then um, we have her closet and she has a full-length mirror I would definitely recommend bringing a full-length mirror um, to college just because it's like it's kind of helpful like look here I am in my pajamas like I don't know it's like it's kind of it's kind of nice to have um and then uh we um uh, hang our towels on our doors of our closets um just so like they can dry and stuff in command hooks like this is like my number one pro college tip bring a million command hooks of all different sizes like we have our lights hung up with command hooks like little big like anything like i have like command strips holding up all of my paintings and i'm assuming Paige does too like honestly they're so helpful like I would really recommend bringing um, command hooks. And then we've got these cubbies up above, um, and they're super nice, they're super deep. And so like I have a lot of stuff in my um, cubbies, like I have like, they're really deep, you can't even see all the way back there, but like I have like makeup and like cleaning supplies and like laundry supplies and like it's nice because um, it's stuff that like I need at college but I don't use on a daily basis so they can go up there. Um, and then we have like our dressers and like this little alcove for our TV, um, and I have like some more stuff like in this basket, mirror behind it, and then um, more cubbies, and then my um, my closet. And so here I'll just give you a little tour of my closet. So I have like my shoes um, up on this like um, oh um, ledge, I guess I don't know what to call it, and then. Uh, shelf shelf that's that would be the word and then I have like I have a lot of clothes like I was able to bring up most of my clothes to college um, and hang them up in there and then um, they, they're very it's a very deep closet too so I have a lot of shoes and stuff in the back of my closet and then I put my you know laundry bag and other stuff like in the front and so like I was able to fit a lot so yeah I don't know that that's our room um, also I would recommend bringing rugs um, we have some like you know fuzzy rugs rugs to match our room and they're definitely like nice because um it's we just have like tile floor um as do all the rooms i believe and so i just think that like rugs are really nice to like add to like the coziness of the room so yeah i don't know i just wanted to like kind of give you a little tour of um a actual room that like college students live in like this is the room I live in, I pinky promise. But yeah, so um, if you have any questions, feel free to comment. I really enjoyed the comments that people have left um, on my later videos. So um, again, any questions, just ask them and I'd love to answer them. All right, see you guys.